Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video of the Osmuth. Today we're going to be doing a video on loving the unloved. Um, and to be honest, out of all the heavy tanks in the game, I would probably say that T1 Tinny 5 and the Conqueror are the least played. So we're going to be playing the Conqueror and the T125 this match. So let's just see if we can uh, do a video. Uh, just going to explain this guy in the video. Um, so yeah, this tank is uh, not very well enjoyed actually. It really is not. I, I've barely seen anybody play this tank anymore because it's just it's just not that good. Um. So I mean, it, it, it may have a 120 millimeter gun uh, that fires on a piercing high explosive blister cap while it's not a very good shell doesn't have that alpha damage that it's meant to have it has the penetration it just does not have the alpha damage 400 damage I'll take that thank you so you can need to swing this gun around there was a T-54 Berlin there I think it's called T-54 Berlin Montage. Wait for this guy to pop over. Smack this. Come on, come on, come on, quickly. Quick, 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 quick. If we could just get behind this hill. Oh, it's T-34. Oh, T-32. Oh, apologies. I mean, uh, the, the, the reload of the 120mm uh, uh, rifle gun, it feel better than it normally is. That's good. At least we got rid of the STB, STA1, my apologies. We need to get rid of that T32 now. It's gonna be a bit it's gonna be a bit tricky to penetrate his turret because he's got the best turret armor in the game. We should be able to back up, make sure that Leo can't hit us with his 105 L7A3. Come on, reload that gun. Get you stuck on these blimmin' trees. Just make sure it's not coming over here. Doesn't look like it, but I don't want to risk it. Uh, where did he go? You just wait for me around this corner. We hit his track. <laughs> oh, we hit his track. That's perfect. Oh, but there is somebody behind us. Pesky little bastard. Now we're nearly dead. T-54B is going to give us a hell of a lot of problems if we're not careful. I 
<laughs> okay, just delete the T62A in one hit. Okay, where's that? We got need 100. We got need 100 problem. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. No! It bounced off. Oh god. We've got a T54 problem now. Yes! We need to be very, very careful here because the oh god. We're about to get deleted. But by who? That's the question. Oh god. T1, uh, E1, I'm just gonna delete us. No, we just reloaded and we couldn't put that shot in. If you angle your armor properly, we did get one lucky bounce. Um, but that T54 hit hit our angled upper plate and it dinged off. And surprisingly, our whole armor is actually really thick at the front. <laughs> really, really thick. So, uh, 2,000 damage, I'll take that. I'll we'll definitely take that. Uh, 1,600 DPM is not bad for this tank. It's actually, it's, it's, I mean, it's more on the meh side than the good side. But, you can't have everything. I mean, it's got 280 millimeters of penetration. That pen's never changed, it's got 2200 hit points. It's got pretty good gun mantle armor, but the gun mantle doesn't cover this too more on here. Uh, basically, this thing, if you want to face this thing, you don't want to hit the gun mantle, or the, you don't have the penetration to hit the gun mantle, or the hole, just aim for this, just hit here. And you're gonna pen him, you're gonna do damage, um, and you're gonna kill him. That's if you have a gun that has more than 127mm pen. Well, has 127mm pen or more. And I believe this thing has something like. Yeah, 10, 10 degrees of gun depression. So we're gonna go this way, we're gonna sneak around. So, uh, so we just want to be a bit careful. Uh, I'm just going to stop here. Because what I want to do is, because we have okay gun velocities, it's just, it's not the best. There doesn't seem to be anybody up there. So we're going to carry on. Oh, hang on a minute. Is that somebody? We're going to turn in. Have our ar armor angled. That's what you want to look about. Oh, we hit his track. Get around the corner, get around the corner, get around the corner. Oh! <laughs> Calling out for help now. You going around behind us? There's no way he's going around behind us. Back up, back up! We don't want him penning our whole armor. Oh, he got a lucky shot in. Come on, come on, aim, 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 aim. We want to angle, ang oh, what happened? He's got 288 millimeters pen, doesn't he? So he's gonna overmatch our front armor like it's nothing. Come on. Now, because the leopard one does sometimes hit for very low damage rolls, um, we're probably gonna 
kill him before he kills us. Bounced off the ledge. No, 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 turn this hurt on. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Don't pen us, don't pen us, don't pen us, don't pen us. Oh, you sneaky little fucking twat. Oh, how much health does this guy even have? Reload, 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 reload. Yes! Y'all, that's lucky. We want 83 hit points. We out... We, well, we didn't out DPM and left one, but he was obviously hitting a lot of low rolls. <sighs> he nearly killed me. He would have killed me um, one more shit. Uh, one, one more shot. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, but we are on 83 hit points out of 2200. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Be a little bit careful because we do have a ginormous tumor on the top of our turret. Oh, oh, I hear somebody moving. Oh, is it? What's that? Oh, it's a type. That's a T54. Oh, it's friendly! That's why! Ooh! Reload, reload, reload. We hit him. Didn't kill him. He's killed the... T-54. Good. Reload. Oh, we killed him! <laughs> right into the side of the hole. Just killed him out. Ooh. Is that, that's somebody sniping. I mean, uh, uh, I don't mind, but it feels like this 120 actually reloads faster than it's actually meant to. I think Greg may have actually buffed it slightly. Uh, oh, really? There's no way we hit that. No way we hit that. That's got to be a mistake. There's no way. Oh, oh, nice, uh, friendly. Ooh, ooh. Don't scare me like that, Mr. T54. That's a tonk. Don't know what tank it is. Want to be a bit careful here. No, no, pen us. He wasn't even looking at us. Ooh. 
we are actually doing pretty well with this tank and this tank is just yeah oh he's in the t62 now he seems to be doing circles whoa okay so uh So this guy just basically just wanted to kill me. Oh, 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 no, don't do that. So we're going to use the Conqueror now. <laughs> this thing is bad. <laughs> it's got the worst DPM out of all the heavy tanks. High tiers, high tier heavy tanks. It's got just over a thousand DPM. And that basically means that this thing sucks. It does have fantastic whole armor. Um, I don't think the left one can pen our whole armor. And we're going to use that against him. Most likely he's going to shoot our turret. But if we cover our turret and just show our hole, chance of him actually... Oh, the shell velocity is so much worse on this tank. The reload is so painfully long with this L L1A1. It's not the L11A1, not on the Chieftain, but it. Oh my god, we've just gone through his turret like hot Matthew butter. Leo 1, Leopard 1 right there. It's not Leopard A1A1 before anybody says, because Leopard A1A1 has spaced armor on the turret. Um, so we're gonna aim, we're gonna aim, aim, aim. Oh, get your flipping gun out of the way. Ah, oh. we're back up. The reverse speed is also not that good on this tank, it really is not. Lost. That sucks. Well, I mean, the Conqueror is. It's not that bad. It's just the reload is not good. The reload is awful. It's worse than the T125. Um. 343 millimeters of frontal armor. Yeah, that's a lot of whole armor. So, that's that. Um, the reason why I'm not adding the T10 into the Love and the Unloved is because the T10 is a good heavy tank. It is good. Um, even though it doesn't have the best DPM, it's got that raw alpha damage. Um, but the Conqueror is one of those tanks where you just got to think yourself, why did I even get this tank? Because, I mean, yeah, it may have been buffed with the armor update, but that fun only lasted for about two, three days. And then that's where the problem started. Um, And uh, what other tank? AMX 50B. And this guy said uh, another tank. I don't know what it was. Uh, an AMX 30. And AMX 30. There you go. Uh, just let you know that Greg in the in a few weeks will add the AMX 50 uh, Brunus and the AMX 30 <sighs> So 
so there's that. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh no! We missed the T54B, so that's gonna bite us in the ass. We're just gonna quickly go over here. We're gonna circle around this tree. Oh god, it's so long. It's so big. Um. And we can't do that kind of <laughs> And we are reloaded, so we've got uh, an APDS, probably an APDS loaded. Uh, on the piston sky and Cebu. Um, I, I don't think we've got Hesh loaded, because Hesh is not bad. Oh god, the SU-85B just got nuked. Uh, oh, hello. How? Did we just bounce off his gun? There's no way we just bounced off his gun. There's no way. There's, there's, there's physically no way we bounced off a tier one. Did we? Oh, God, that's the T-54B. Is he going to come around this corner? Oh no! <laughs> yeah! Oh no! <laughs> Thought we damaged him. We did it really. Oh god. It's a YOLO wagon. It's YOLO! <laughs> Kill the YOLO wagon! <laughs> he would have killed us. Because our turret armor sucks. It is that bad. Turret armor is really that bad. I'm not a joke. Yes, we finally actually damaged the T-54B. Ooh, where's an M385 pattern? Uh, oh, there's another corporate. So we're going to set up here and make ourselves the biggest target ever. Hello. Killed him. M4 Sherman is down. Where's the E100? Is the E100 actually dead? Oh my god, he actually is. The gun depression still sucks, honestly. That was a quick shot. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Where did that come from? That came from somewhere. Oh, it's an M4. How did he... I think he hit our turret. So aim, 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 aim. APDS right in the side of his M4. So that's good. So the Conqueror, again, is a tank that he, that everybody practically hates. This thing just is just rubbish. Um, I personally like it because it's a, it's a British tank. I like the T-125 as well and the reason why I like both these machines is because nobody focuses on them and uh, I just like to focus on them so thank you guys for watching this video I hope that you enjoyed this video if you did enjoy this video give it a thumbs up if you didn't enjoy this video give it a thumbs down put in the comment section what you think about these two tanks um, and uh, if you want to see another loving the unloved video see you guys later